All right, I'm gonna try to record this. This is like a road to nowhere. <laughs> it's kind of funny, but this is one of the things I have to deal with that the new property is um, things like this. Um, this is, there's a fence to the left, a fence to the right, and here I am stuck in the middle with grass. Um, the grass gets kind of unruly back here in the shaded part. There we go, it's adjusting a bit. But then, we get back over here, and this oak tree and its Spanish moss has really taken control of what's going on back in there. And there's a tree growing right there. There's actually a tree growing up from there. And I went back along this side of the fence over here, and there's just a fence. This is just a fenced-off area. There's a there's nothing here. So it's like it's a funny little a funny little road between penned in areas, I guess. This is barbed wire fence on the top and just, you know, fencing down here. And the fence around the house is all strands of barbed wire, which is crazy. And then um, this area here, this area here is just like uh, gone wild. And I'm gonna have to really spend a lot of quality time in working with this and trying to clean this up. Because this used to be some kind of like a little riding area too. Maybe, you know, walk a horse over here if you wanted to. And hang out under the shade trees and all that. I think they would be really pleasant. Or for whatever, you know, for whatever anybody might want to do. You know, if all this was cut down to grass height and maintained, it wouldn't be too hard to maintain it once it gets there. I see to get it there. In fact, if you look out over that tree, underneath that tree right there, that's the barn. There's a barn right there. And we really can't see it. I see a blue barrel out there in the distance. <laughs> right through the middle of all those trees, that's where the apartment thing is. Anyway, so, you know, but that's it. You know, this area like this, this, you know, I want the whole property to pretty much look like this over here. All green grass for my friends in Ireland, the green of Ireland. And, uh, you know, that's, you know, that's the way I want the whole thing to be. And this, uh, this area back over here, where that palm tree is, that's the area I was cutting the grass at as well. So I did get quite a bit of the property actually cut uh, with the lawnmower. And I did that whole area there. I did this road, I reclaimed this road, it was overgrown right here. But I was able to reclaim that. And I reclaimed this road here too. This road was overgrown right here. So I really couldn't really walk here before. Um, and this stuff right here, I, oddly enough, underneath these shade trees right here, was pretty much the worst. I, I didn't want to ride over limbs and stuff like that. I just wanted to get the grass cut back. It was like this. On the other side of the fence over here, the tall grass, that's what was growing in this road. And it takes over fast. You know, it doesn't doesn't really, uh, you know, meander about that. It just, nature will take back the property very, very quickly. And then um, lastly is uh, two areas. Right in front of me is the barn. And I don't want this to go too long. So I'm gonna cut, I'm gonna pause this and then pick it back up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick it up over there. All right, so this is a fence. This is that road? I reclaimed that road. This whole road was overgrown. This area right here, thankfully, this is the entrance to this area, and thankfully, this is you know it's high grass, but I can get in there. But I'm gonna have to walk through all that stuff because these trees drop branches all the time. So I'm gonna have to pull the branches away, the big ones, and then I raise the uh, cutting blades way high, and I can go through and cut most of that down. I've discovered, and uh, but this whole area. I don't know what they had here. Here's a couple little pens right here. Maybe they had some pigs or something, I don't know. And then, uh, so that's a whole separate area. This area right here where these trees are, the shade trees and everything, see, I think that would be great, you know, for any kind of a, a billion different reasons. This area here is, that's the apartment. I don't like the apartment, but it's here. I think some caretaker years and years, because the apartment was here before the house. The, the apartment has been here as long as probably the barn according to Google Earth, you know, going back in history kind of thing. Um, but then again, we got these big broken branches around here. 
I have to pull these things out. But then, I'm going to pause this again. I'm going to go over past that blue barrel and I'll pick up the video again. Okay, sorry about the wind and stuff. I got, I'm just hand holding my phone. I'm using the built in microphone and all that kind of stuff. Um, I actually hit this hose with the lawnmower. I don't know if you can see it. Let me get a little closer. Hopefully, the camera will adjust. There we go. I actually whacked this hose with the mower. I was really ticked off about that. But I got to cut all this heavy stuff down here. There's the apartment. I got to cut all this stuff down too. But because of the branches and stuff like that, I didn't get all that. But I did cut all this down. I was very happy with that. But this is what I was most happy with because this area here was a really nice, I mean, the barn is right there, right? I got to cut down part of the fences down over there. I'm gonna have to fix that. Uh, that is a pump house. Um, I would have to basically have that rebuilt. I'm sure the pump well is fine. I just need to, that pressure tank has got to go. But anyways, so that's the barn area, but this land right here. Now there's a neighbor's house um, over there in the background, but all this grass here was way high. It was like this. All this high grass here, all of this was like that. And I took my mower on the highest setting and I cut off, uh, I cut down all of this area over here. So now we're reclaiming this land. Now here's the real kicker. All that overgrown stuff back there, which is way, way overgrown. That was a nice field for uh, horse riding as well. And I really want to reclaim all of that um, as well. So I'm gonna have to go back in there with a machete axes and stuff like that and just really take a long time to hack that out there's a good probably a couple of acres in there i mean the fence line is the neighbor's property but i'd really love to have like a nice riding area or something or hiking area through these woods over here i think i can clean that out again it's going to take me a while but you know where there's a will where there's a way motivation dedication determination right all right i'm gonna wrap this video up until i catch you guys in the next video take care and be well